Now to more breaking news from Lakeside, where firefighters on the ground will be working through the night to keep a brush fire from growing any bigger. This is here near Barona. In just the past few hours, the Wildcat fire tripled to 150 acres. Right now, it's just 10% contained. 10 News reporter Emily Valdez is on the scene with a massive effort to keep the flames away from people living nearby. The Wildcat fire is charred 150 acres so far. It is just 10% contained. I want to show you what firefighters are up against this dry brush right here. It is fuel and ready to burn. I literally had to jump on my bike and turn around. And Dustin Montiel rode his dirt bike over the hill from his home on the Barona Indian Reservation to see the Wildcat fire for himself. It's like a wall of fire pretty much. I mean, like in the movies, you know, when you... There's fire everywhere. The flames? Like 40, 50, 60 feet. Like, yeah, it was pretty crazy. Then the wind changed. I ended up getting really close, and <laughs> I got a little bit too close, and I had to take off real quick. The Wildcat fire is burning just north of the Barona Indian Reservation. Crews were dropping water on the fire in the daylight hours from four air tankers and four helicopters. The battle from the air was stopped for the night, but several hundred firefighters are still on the ground. The fire touched one home, but crews were able to fight it back and save the house. I'm concerned about the whole reservation. You know. Wednesday evening, the fire was burning away from Wildcat Canyon, but the fire is not contained. I'll probably be up for most of the night. Now fire crews are going to watch what the fire does overnight. At the Barona Indian Reservation, Emily Valdez, 10 News.